I don't know what the fuck happened, but my stream just cut off. I guarantee there's no, no other device on in my house right now, bro. That's crazy. It's insane, man. From the 27, Love. No! I was about to say they're gonna let him complete that shit. Come on, man. Wow, wow, wow. Here and get the football right back because your friend, old momentum, he's wondering if he should change sidelines about right now. And if you don't convert here, guess what? He's gonna make the trek to the opposite side. And all of a sudden, you've got a battle on your hands. On third down, love. <laughs> oh my God, bro! Are you serious? That's a pick. first down as they're able to he get threw a pick. conversion. And now we get into the psychology of the whole thing because a lot of teams with a two-score lead. In the oh my God, bro! Become defensive with their offense, just playing not to lose. I think he threw this a pick, dog. At this point. This is a great spot for them to go man, into. Man, oh man. Really try and put the hammer down and finish this one off. Man, oh man. First down going to the air with love. A check down here to Jones. Stand flat over there, plus the man coverage. Just four, second down. Well, offensively, that's the mismatch that you want. You want to force a linebacker to try and cover your back out of the backfield, out in some open space. But linebackers nowadays, they run like backs, and they take a lot of pride in covering. What a nice play he made there in the open field. Mm, mm, mm. Coming up on a second and six. He didn't tackle him, dog. He didn't tackle him, dog. I lost my fucking mind. I think the hope is, you know, with a touch pass like that, maybe you catch the defense off guard. I would have lost my fucking mind, dog. And it is the kind of play that works better against certain defenses, and this clearly was the wrong one to run into. Really nice job getting him down behind the line of scrimmage. Now on third and long, they'll look to throw. Pressure, and he's taken down. A bear sack. Julian Okwara gets in there to drop him for a loss of 13 yards, and it's also fourth down now. On now is the Packers punter. And the way this offense has moved the ball, he hasn't been needed till here in the third. On the return, Johnson. And he goes out of bounds just shy of the 45. A nice return that time gets 12 yards back. And the Bears take over. The Bears offense ready to go for their next drive. They come in off a touchdown drive the last time they had the ball to cut down that lead. Now the defense has done their part, got them the football back. Momentum started to shift a little bit when they scored the touchdown. It increased when the defense got them the ball back. Momentum definitely in their favor. Now they got to keep things cranking, keep it on high so they can keep cutting into that lead. Here's a throw to his running back. It's complete. And he's going to be out of bounds, but not before he takes it inside the 40. Another catch for him there on this drive, Brandon. And it looks like they're going to utilize him out of the backfield any way they can. And that time, they pick up a first down. So now on defense, do you assign a man to him and try and cover him before he gets going? On first down, Drummond. And he's going to get a solid gain of nine before being brought down. Second and right at a yard. The previous run, good for nine. Here's second and a yard. Here's Fields. He's going to flip one out here to his running back. And he'll be a little shy of the 25 here at the 26-yard line. They'll run on first down. Yo, come on. I didn't have control of the damn running back, man. Come on, dog. Second down. Jesus, man. looked for that run pass option. You get the sense... The next time he has that opportunity, he may keep it himself and get to the perimeter. Probably owes his back a little bit of an apology on that one, huh? 
From the 24, Fields. Eluding the pressure right. Passing oh, roughing the passer? Roughing the passer. Roughing the passer. Yes, sir, Rebob. The hit comes late. We saw it. There's your flag. And we know that there's a guideline, right? Ball's gone. You get one step. If you're within one step of the quarterback, you can hit him as long as it's still done legally. But anything outside of that looks like an extra step was involved. Johnson's got it complete. Touchdown, Bears. In there, baby. A great play there. His 19th touchdown now on the season. And the Bears are able to get a score back in the final stages of this third quarter. Point after, right down the middle. And now things get a bit more interesting here in this fourth quarter. One quarter remains here as we wrap up the week on a Monday night. So we'll return with more after this. You're watching the NFL on EA Sports. So they will accept the penalty and move forward. So good field position for the Packers as they come up first and 10 at the 40. Now a handoff running left is Jones. Two yards on the carry there. It'll be second down. I'm sure that that's going to be the formula. Just keep the ball on the ground. Keep that clock moving. And when you have the lead this late in the game, above all, stay in bounds. Yes, take care of the football. Yes, gain yardage, but stay in bounds and let that clock tick. The last run got a couple. Here's second and eight. The play fake love. Yep. And the ball comes Bitch. out. Fuck you, nigga. We out here. Oh boy, you ain't got no feet. She say you ain't got no feet. <laughs> say you ain't got no feet. Why? Yeah, he is. And a big turning point here in the second half, Charles, after that play. All you're trying to do is change momentum, flip things around for your team. You're just trying to take the ball away. How about when you take it away and score? That Dang. really changes things. The extra point up and good. And that will make this a four. I'll take 28 on acid in the second half. Let's fucking go, boys. And you can bet they're preaching two hands on the ball here as the kicks away following that fumble return. From a couple yards deep, he'll bring it out of the end zone. <sighs> One more stop, boys. About set to get this drive started. The Green Bay offense at the line. And now they'll look to answer working from behind. And remember, this no offense fucking is way, dog. Yet to score here in the second half. They'll need to change that here. And he's taken down, but able to slip across the 35. 131 yards on the ground for him now as he has gotten better, really, as the night's gone on. So here's a first and 10 at the 38. They'll run it with Jones. I ranked him at right, and we st he still and gets he yards. Up quickly here. Just a yard up to the 39. Wow. Bro. Ladies and gentlemen, that is a force of nature in the defensive tackle position. Yes, he's as big as they come, but still plenty agile. He's able to make a nice play there to swallow up the ball carrier. Here's second and nine, just a yard on that last run. Now a draw play, this is Jones. And he takes this up right near the 45-yard line. 
Give him six yards on the carry. It's going to be third and three now. Frustrating for a defense, energizing for an offense. Finding a way to create that type of yardage in your running game, that'll make the guys carrying the ball very, very happy. The Packers on third down. They're at 50%, four for eight. This time it's third and three. Throwing. Love. It's a hard play. That's a hard play. And he's going to have a Packers first. Come on, man. Yards as they're able to convert here on third. The pass committed hard flat, bro. Like, success throughout this contest. Stop it, Madden. Fuck. There he picks up another first down. Whatever they saw going into this one, they've been able to capitalize on it, and no adjustment has been made to take it away. From the midfield stripe, they'll look to throw. And the Dumbass. Hello, Rose. good night. And this is picked up by the Bears. The 20. That's thirsty. Mm, let's go, baby. Khalil Mack on his ass. Thank you. This was a close game. They needed a little breathing room. Boy, they got it right there on that return for a touchdown. Yeah, we would say that this could be huge. Forget it. It was huge. Gave him a comfortable lead. 35. Unanswered. Second half points. Let's fucking go, boys. So here's the kickoff now as he'll get it again following that fumble return for a score. The boy crumbled. They don't like playing with that momentum, huh? Mm -hmm. The Packer offense ready to get their next drive underway. And they weren't on the sidelines for long, but I'll tell you what, I'm glad you and I weren't down there. We could hear them, <laughs> the coaches from all the way up here. They were adamant you've got to hold on to the football or else we have no hope. Yeah, it's easy for me to laugh sitting up here, but you're exactly right. If we were down there, that message would have been received a whole different way. Because turnovers, they've been a big problem for them. Got to take care of the football got to hold on to it so following the incompletion here second and 10 from the 25 out of the shotgun it's Jones that's that bullshit man five as he gets it to the 30 that second down play call was not to pick up the first down it was to accomplish what they did to get them into a manageable third down because they had the incompletion on first down so they were behind the sticks so to speak they need to make up some ground and they did Here's Love. Flush to his right. <laughs> Let's go, rookie. Get this big ass thing up off my field. Let's get it. Neither defense has been at their best, but these guys, they've been a little bit better, Charles, and a nice interception there. Yeah, you're right about that, Brandon. Let's face it. It's not always how you start, it's how you finish, right? So maybe you have a rough game all the way along. Yeah, he's oh, in the end zone, touchdown, Chicago. Ah! Jarnell Mooney, 51 yards. And the Bears add on to their lead, and it's looking like that win Hello, good is night. going to extend another week. Point after, up and good. And the lead is 42 and 93 points now. in the second half. Let's fucking get it. The kickoff unit is out on the field, and they will send this one away. Very short kick, taken right at the 20. And they've got it up past the 35, so pretty good starting field position. <laughs> About set to get this drive started, the Green Bay offense at the line. And they've sort of lost their way, partner. How do they recalibrate and get this proverbial train? <laughs> <contract? laughs> I didn't have a D-line there was a linebacker. That's a pig. Ah, ah, the offensive coordinator. Sometimes they just make a joke. All right, guys, you had your fun? All right, throw it out the window. Yeah, let's get back on track here. And sometimes that'll work just fine. I guess it's time now to lean on that leadership. First down, love to pass. Looking deep for oh, wow. Adams. I got Russell on the same route. I, he wrote, I wrote to him on. And finally scored some points. 
His second touchdown of the night. And the Packers have got it back to a two-score game here in the fourth. Thank you very much. They didn't get a good hit. Score touchdown, bro. I don't care. I mean, look, you're still two scores to the good CD, but things may be a little more uncomfortable than they had hoped. Yeah, if you kept him out of the end zone there. This and this is intercepted. <laughs> and that should do it. Picked off by Landon Collins. And he's into the clear. He's at the 50. Because fuck you, that's why, my nigga. Just a yard or two shy of midfield. Come play some defense, boy. Come play some defense, boy. Send this one away. And this will not be returnable. It's out of the back of the end zone for a touchback. At the line, prepping for their next drive, the Bears offense. If they can score here, they have a chance to make this a three-possession game and all but put things to bed. And that'll be Wowzers. All right, I hear you out here with people. Down, however, let's see what it's about. So a costly penalty yardage wise is that'll move the football down to the spot of the foul. And what the officials are looking for in these situations, whether you're playing the man or the ball. And if you're playing the man, you get a lot less leeway in terms of what's going to happen at the end of the play. But if you're looking for the football, it's less likely to draw the flag. Oh, I like that right there. Not only was it the right play, throwing it away like that. Frankly, I think it was the only play. Yeah, got outside of the pocket, realized he had nothing, just chucked it free. Yeah, lived to fight another down, right? No gain on that one as it brings up a third and ten. From the gun, here's Fields. And wow, that's some horse shit. Picked off by Jair Alexander and a return across midfield okay. and to the 46 yard line. Now with that interception, you feel like we're out of ball game again. Remember, a two score contest and still time left here. <laughs> and in the old days, <laughs> I really did just throw that against Jair, though. That was not smart. Throwing the ball here would have been an absolute no no, but the way the game's played now. Throwing it makes sense. You just have to be careful when you put it in the air. Following the interception, Love. Throwing the out route incomplete. It's Connor. Yeah, he is out of bounds, but not before he's inside the 30. Clock management, definitely critical here if they want to get back in this game. Absolutely agreed. They have to up the tempo in this case, down a couple of scores. Want to make sure they have a chance to win this ball game. Going for it all. Got a man. Oh, Yo, what the fuck? Downs. Touchdown. Green That's Green. so stupid. Devontae okay. Adams. Cool beans. 29 yards. And the cool beans. <laughs> the uprights, and now That's just funny. More interesting here in this fourth quarter. The kickoff team on the field now as they will send this one away. And they will not get a chance to return this one as it's through the end zone for a touchback. The Bears offense ready to go for their next drive. I'm curious to see, Charles, about the play calling on this drive. Last time out, the interception that led to a touchdown. Here we are. I mean, very close. One score game. Yeah, and if I'm a defender, I'm actually chirping to the, on the other side of the ball. Said, hey, we picked off the last one. What you going to do about it now? <laughs> so when you do throw the football, high percentage, but throw it with confidence. And got his man complete. And he just falls short down at the one-yard line. A huge play there for Chicago. Steps up into the pocket. So the Bears with the football here as we welcome you back. They've got it first and goal as they search for what could be a game ceiling touchdown. And no signal, but I don't think he got the surge behind center. No, he's going to be kept out of the end zone. A 
Now here's Fields on the sneak, and he'll get in. He's over for the touchdown. Justin Fields keeping it himself from a yard out. And the Bears extend this fourth quarter lead, and they are getting closer and closer to win number 11. It was looking pretty bleak for us early on, fellas. They're going for two. They'll kick the point after. Welcome this young man to the 50 bottom club. And he's been a busy man. Five for five now as he knocks another one through to extend the lead. Set now to kick this one away, and off it goes. And a fair catch signaled for and taken successfully. The Packer offense ready to get their next drive underway. And they're hoping to redo their efforts in the last drive when they got into the end zone. And just think of what it's like now on the sideline. Because when you score a touchdown, you really through that look at the tablet and see what you did on the last drive. When you score points, it's a whole lot better view than when you're trying to figure out how to fix things there. So the incompletion, and now it's second and ten again from the 25-yard line. Love. Able to find Jones. And he'll be out of bounds across the 30-yard line. They get six. That'll leave them with third and four. And we see another pitch and catch there to the running back. This position just continues to evolve. They become just as critical to the passing attack as a lot of receivers' tight ends because their ability to make people miss in the open field can really generate big plays for an offense. And this is dropped. Oh, it's incomplete. He had a big gainer nope. in sight. Nope. Wrong number. Yeah. To something you said in the first quarter. Is, about it, is, is it a positive? It is a positive. Okay. Well, about winning the turnover battle. As a visiting <laughs> team, as an underdog, you were right. They've done just that, and look where it's gotten them. It's part of the formula. When you go on the road, as you mentioned, being an underdog, winning the turnover battle is a big key, and this one's playing out in this one. All right, they're going to try and keep hope alive here on fourth down. They're going for it. Desperation time here. Love on fourth down. Wow. He's going to have his running back. It's complete. And he'll be out of bounds just shy of the 40. A big play there on the catch and run. Felt compelled to go for it there on fourth down, trailing in the fourth quarter. They got it done. And there's always a lot of pressure on a fourth down call. Doesn't matter the distance. You still have to get it done, as you noted. And they did. Jordan Love ready on first down here. Ooh, this is you thought, catch, you thought. What? And the Bears will take over here. Ah, you mean, what? Get it up to the 43 yard line. Boy, what a turnaround they ah, had. Ah, you mean, what? And now all of this, what's happened? So when you start to write your novel, you'll start out with, it was a tale of two halves, won't you? Right, but I'm a bad writer. <laughs> I don't know exactly what happened because sometimes... Packer pressure and down he goes. Thanks for running again. Jalen Smith. Let's see something. He's the one to get him, and that is sack number seven for him on the year. Now it looks like he'll throw here. Escaping the pressure right. And he'll be out of bounds after getting this one across the 40. He'll wind up getting four there on his own, but it will leave him now with a third down situation. Here's Fields. That's complete to his running back, Herbert. And they'll get this well past oh, before being stopped just before 45. Yeah, we're ready. 
Well, Charles, it's one thing to win. It's another thing to win and put up the amount of points that they did. Boy, were they clicking on offense. They can't help but feel great about themselves, can they? I mean, what a game to put up that number of points, continually feeling like they're moving the ball and things are working and clicking. They think that they can bottle this and carry it with them. And as an offensive coordinator, you just don't think you can do anything wrong. Whatever you call, run, pass, it's all going to work. That's called being in the zone. So for Chicago, they continue to keep pace for that first round bye as they move to 11-1. And, and they'll get another road test next week as they head to Jacksonville to take on the Jaguars. Meanwhile, for Green Bay, they fall to 6-6 six six now on the campaign. And they'll look to regroup next week as they head to MetLife Stadium to take on the New York Giants. Gave me a tough out, 62.9%. Mm-hmm. Didn't two picks to you, but... Yeah, yeah, we did our thing. 440 yards, yeah. Yeah, man. <clears throat> Six for 77. This is the best receiver. And uh, Devontae Adams is doing Devontae Adams 99 overall shit. Okay. Four for 92 for the rookie. Uh, three for fifty for the other rookie. Now, I will say, I will say, we got two fucking sack fumbles. <laughs> so I, I ain't going to sit here and act like, you know, some, uh, a little bit of outlandish shit ain't happened. I mean, one was Khalil Mack, one was a rookie. So, I mean, they, they shared, they actually both shared, like, I think Mack forced one and Bowyer recovered, and then Bowyer forced one and Mack re recovered the other one. It was actually pretty funny. Hopefully, they both of them in the highlights. Hopefully both of them are in the highlights. I don't think we hit our 15 first downs. Oh, we did. We did. Okay, cool. We hit our 15 first downs, so that's that's what's up. Um, even I think we actually have spent all of the coach points we need to spend, <laughs> to be honest. Three for six on third. He was five for 11 on third. I know one of his third downs, so it was a 39. I fucking ran command like a dumbass. That was, that was not smart. Yo, look at that shit, bro. 49 points in the second half to win this game. Like, bro, Mans was up 27 to 3. That's wild, man. Yo, you took the 27 zip lead. That's wild, bro.
this is a stretch simulator. And I, for whatever reason, I don't I don't know what I don't know what caused him to start passing the ball in the second half. Maybe he needed stats or whatever, but dog. We were starting to box that run for some losses. Third and ten we got sacked, forced to punt. Was that our first drive? I believe it was. I'm actually gonna do this shit old school recap style. 